Greetings, my Dowie brethren. Welcome to the Dwarven Hold of Darkhaven. Things are going pretty well, I say slightly hesitantly, but I do think so. This could switch at any moment. We have many enemies around us, limited funds, one decent army, and that's it. We have got these two mini armies, which are going to act as deterrents. I'm hoping to get this army up and start raiding here. I can repeatedly sack that. Uh, I think that's a good idea. I might even pop up, have a little, a little look. Yeah. I think that would be good. Oh, hang on. But I've got to be careful here. And I might run him back in for now. I'm not going to be able to afford to... Oh, I might be able to afford to recruit this turn. Let's pull him back. Just up there. Got to be careful. Even if um, the Exiles of Nehek take this, we can still just sack it. I think that's a great idea to level up another Lord there. And equally, Iron Frost. We're going to be able to sack that repeatedly with this Lord once he's up and running. So, two good ideas there, I believe. But, at the end of the last episode, I promised you another quest battle, and I shall deliver. After these brief checks, I could put some more regiments of renown in. Dragon Black. Dragonback Slayers are good, but my upkeep is not. I think we're going to have to fight it with just this. Uh, what is balance of power? Easily in our favour, apparently. That means <laughs> we're all going to die horribly, horribly. That can't be it. At this level, there's got to be more going on. I'm going to group up super carefully. In fact, I might even turtle up at the back. I'm sure they're going to ambush us in some form. Excuse me. Slurping. Oh. Oh. Ursular have been caught sneaking about like rat men filth, trying to gain access to our mountains unseen. Well, I see you, scum, and by Valea's cloak, I'll have every last rotten one of you back in that ground, pushing up your tombstones. A rousing speech from our commander there. Yeah, I bet they're going to come storming in down the sides there. Oh. Do I run backwards? We don't miss. Yeah, let's see. Oh, I still haven't got my hero. I was going to do the extra movement. I think we try and run backwards. I can sacrifice... Grom Brindle will probably do quite well on his own. I'm going to run the army backwards. Because I don't like the look of this at all. I'm sure something's going to come out of somewhere. And again, even then we're not that well protected. I can't go any further back than that. Speed things up. Just going to protect my artillery pieces. This 5,000 will enable us to upgrade our home province to tier 3. Which means we're not that far off from getting some actually exciting units.
I'm sure something's going to come. Every quest battle, I thought something pops up. How are you finding the campaign so far, guys? I would love to hear from you. Positive or negative? I'd love to hear your opinion. Positive is better, though. <laughs> Be delicate with me. I'm just an old Dowie. Alright, what's going on here? I wonder if I can literally charge in and kill the Lord on my own. What's that? Quick rules? Yeah, I'll kill them. We do magical damage, don't we? Aha, uh -huh, what's this? I knew it. Terror, terror geists? Cool, I haven't seen them for ages. I do love some undead. Gonna hurt, I'm sure. Yeah, that did hurt. Well, if you've got a bass infestation, you know who you need to call <laughs> Iron Drakes. Is that Vargeists? Okay, yeah, they're pretty cool. So, yeah, they've got in relatively well, to be fair to them. Let's get them off. Some minor damage I can accept. Oh, don't shoot your own men. Terrorgeist crumbling. Okay, that's the end of that. Terrorgeist dead. Okay. Pull them back. Pull them back. Grombrindle down the centre. We're definitely missing our priest, uh, excuse me, rune lord, rune smith. Nice. Gumbrindle has no fear is an excellent ability. We've just got to kill the lord here. Which should just be a matter of time. No, don't do that. They're about to throw bombs at our own guys. Okay, we've taken some damage here. I don't really want to take much more. Some bombs over there. Grombindle is doing his thing. Okay, 
Okay. Uh, not too bad, you know. Definitely be able to repel an army if we go attacked. An easy-ish army. Yeah, good. Still got some space. The Horrors of the Night. I think that's a lovely name for an undead army. Horrors of the Night. <laughs> or a, a track on a particularly black black metal album. Okay, let's keep going. Ooh, do I want the money? No. Drink to victory. The Cloak of Vallea. Hey, hey, hey. Uh, enemy hero action success chance. Meh. Minus five corruption. That's fantastic. Surrounded by chaos. Melee defense plus six. Brilliant. Spell resistance. Mm. And physical resistance. Very nice. How can I help? Right. Do I move up? Don't you fret. It's done. See, there's not much difference if I'm in... Uh, in camp, so I think we can move up to here. Oh, I'd love to give him more units, but we can't. We've got to spread it. So, tier 3. 4,000. Beautiful. We've still got 5,000 after that. A bit more growth in Rakdo. The wall's going up in Rakdo Gorge. Definitely troops there. Skill point. Age of Vengeance. Yes, please. Oh, I could go... Oh, no. I thought Mentor was available. Yeah, Age of Vengeance. Even more armor piercing. That's going to help. Big time. You know who I am. Uh, what's the ambush success chance here? Why not? Try and ambush somebody. Why not? Our little hero is there. We are looking down upon Nagarond. Do I want to go for it? Not sure. We need to see what else is going on. I don't want to go in and get hit by three other units. This is about to rebel. Uh, I'm going to abandon the settlement. Although, hang on. Hang on. Can we... What's going to come out of it, do you think? Probably Beastmen. We'll see what... Oh, it's risky. It's a guaranteed 440. It's also less aggro yet. Let's just abandon it. Rather than get myself in a pickle. It's served its purpose. It's made us some money. It's going to make us one little bit of money. Oh, we lose 200. Oh, <laughs> decisions. Um, decisions, decisions. There's a chance I could repel it. I'd have to put a lord in it, which is more money. No, get rid of it. Okay, it's going to hit our upkeep. We have got a little bit more money coming there. Okay, Grand Brindle. Imminent Rebellion. Yes, we've sorted that out. Let's check our diplomacy. Supreme. Grand. The Unparalleled power. No point. They'll be dead soon. And who knows what good faction I'm going to taint by forming an alliance with Foul Druki.
and in the turn. Ah. It's a shame. I probably could have repelled that. Aha. Uh -huh. Here we go. Where is he? There comes Kartep. I'm kind of ready for him. Kind of not. Already got four quarrelers and a lord. Oh. I didn't need to abandon it. That is a shame. Oh. Hang on a minute. Uh... Uh, what happened there? I did click on abandon, but it's still there somehow. Right. We've got a problem there. How powerful is... They are slightly more powerful than us. It's got to be at least one full stack, hasn't it? I'm going to run him down. Two lords and a lot of crossbows should save. What have we got? A little garrison as well. Can't have him rampaging through. Don't want to start war with them yet. I'm sure we will be going to war with them sooner than later. Okay, I'm gonna have a little little look. That's it. They haven't got anything else we can take. Nagarond here. Uh is that advisable? I think it is. Is that really all they've got in there? I think I might have to physically attack it. Let me just put my head over there. Okay, there's Malekith. So... Ah, we've got regiments of renown too down here. I think if I put Skag Steelbirth behind. Oh, decisions. He's got to be close. If they've just taken that, he's got to be close. We'll cross that bridge in a moment. Let's deal with this issue. It's saying Valiant Defeat. They do have a lot of missile troops, but let's shoot down the uh, shoot down the towers. Yeah. Fight them on the walls. Their own towers are going to shoot their own men. We can move up when they haven't got the towers and bombard them. I think we'll win. It'll be a little bit of a drawn out one. But it'll be worth it. And we'll come out of it in a decent state. Does lightning strike do anything? I thought it used to change their leadership slightly. I'm just going to see if there's anything we can get Oath Gold wise. I will be right back.
Okay. What can we give them to help with this siege? Open armor. Uh, we can give him the opal amulet. Yeah. He's got all his runes. So we've got space for his enchanted armor. Uh, excuse me, enchanted iPhone and armor. I'm sure we can get some armor. Missile resistance, absolutely. Uh, Ranger's cloak for him and enchanted items. Speed, armor. Yeah, I mean, it's not the most exciting. Uh, physical resistance, that will help against missiles. And do we have any? Uh, that'll do, yeah. Okay, so give him some armor and give him the Slayer's Belt. That's going to make him a bit more resistant. Not bad. Now, we also want to think about this Lord here, right? Who is. He's got. What has he got? Nothing. Let's pimp him out. We can give him some fury. And uh, he needs everything else. So he needs a weapon. Bonus first of infantry. What we want for him. He's going to be wading in amongst these dead. Uh, we're going to give him armor and leadership. Yeah. Hold the line longer. We're going to give him a talisman. Slayer's Ring, Ward Save, Hold the Line Longer. We're going to give him... Well, <laughs> Slayer's Belt. Sorry, it's not the most exciting selection of items. And that's all my Oath Gold, which is nice. My anger burns I do like the Oath Gold system. The last time I played Dwarfs... Oh, I did play with some Thoric, but before that I played Dwarves, they didn't have this system. That's how long ago I played them. I played them a lot in Warhammer 1. I might give him the Rune of Spite. Because uh, he's going to need it more. Rune of Burning. Yeah, and then we can give him the Grudge Thrower. The special one. But before that, we need to see how much money we're going to get. So, we need to really kick some butt here and win this cleanly. I can't be taking heavy losses. Malekith has got three quarters of a stack. He will be on us before we know it, probably the next turn. With some luck the turn after. So we might get some time to replenish. We might not. Shoot the towers down with our grudge throwers. Allowing us to move up and shoot them as we see fit from this angle here. Probably fine. And in fact, yeah, I can put them right there. Oh, I didn't mean to group them. Take them and put them on guard mode. I don't want them at fire at will. Put these guys out of the range. Should be out of range there. Okay. Now, these two are going to run. Straight and up the wall. Yeah, okay. Coming from this side, I should only get shot by one tower. So, let's put them onto control group one. 
Start a battle. Shoot that tower. You two. Up the wall. So, they're going to desperately try and shoot my lords as they run around on the top of the wall. Oh, oh and they can hit me there. I didn't think they could. Oh, they've got ridiculous range. Mistake number one. Uh, oh, we'll be alright, we'll be alright. So much for not taking too much damage. Got to shoot that tower. It's almost gone. Should be the last volley into us. They've pinned us down. There goes the tower. Can it shoot us? No. No more targets for you. Okay, so we can start lobbing shots in over the top, but I'm going to wait. Come on, they should bring people up to challenge us. There we go. Who's that? Black Guard of Nagarond. Stuff still be going off. They've both got some damage resistance going now. Oh, he's taking a beating. Increase his melee attack. Let's focus on killing them. Right, we can move up. Start raining down fire. I think we might have to pull the runesmith off. He's taking a beating. Yeah, he is. Try and get him out of there. Ron Brindle. Take care of them. Oh, shades. Might be a mistake. I need to get him off the wall. That was a mistake. He might make it, actually. Shots going in. How's he doing? Brilliantly, not terribly. Go on, Brindle. There we go. Shots coming into them. Can I get him down? Rindor's gone down. I didn't want to do that. Oh. I didn't want to bring them up either. Oh. Pull back. Pull back. 
Well, we might have to go in now. It's all gone wrong. There's a shit coming in. Nice. It's not going terribly. Apart from that, I said move. I definitely told them to move. So shitting. <laughs> Excuse me, sitting there. They may well be shitting there. You don't know. just running around on his own down there. Why can't I target them? Move him up. Try and blow up some shades. Ah, uh, cancel. That wasn't too bad. Oh no, he's exposed here. That's dead. Up we go. Gates open, are they? Don't want to lose that hero. Where is he? Come back. Okay, we've got the tower. And they've... I thought they decimated my artillery there. Stop! Vengeance! It is an order! Move oh, on, window. This takes me back. Slow going, but we're doing alright. Doing alright. Haven't lost a hero yet. He is taking a bit of damage. find it slightly strange that uh, he can't go down the ladder. Let's go and kill their lord. We got him outside. I think we're going to get him outside. Taking some shots for sure. Let's grab all the infantry. What are you doing? Come on, get up on the walls, guys. He's quite happy there. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing? The catapults have decided to come in. And this is the part where we charge in, get right next to the enemy, and just stand still and get shot, which is what I was very much trying to avoid. 
he drives me up the absolute wall. Ugh. It's a nightmare. Let's get into their lord here. Yep, sorry, these shades push them off. Why have the catapults come in? I don't know. It's just stupid. It drives me up the wall. This is pushing him back. They're in. They're in combat. Just get up there. What are you doing? Stood there. We have to go round the barricade to attack them. Awful. And I swear I put them on guard. Those catapults. I did. Okay. Let's try and shoot stuff. The leadership is dropping. Who stood there doing nothing? These guys. Oh, <laughs> oh I hate. Assaulting Dark Elf settlements. What's Brombrindle doing? Running around up and down on a barricade. Lord. Ready to strike. And then because I can't micromanage well enough, all the enemy units are gonna, gonna come flying back. grasp apparently you wouldn't know that because you're in our guys are stood there doing nothing and the archers are just still on the wall what are you doing I've told them to come off repeatedly that might have done it please be over Iron Drake's still on the wall. I told them to move up repeatedly. I hate siege battles with a fiery passion. But that one is over. And our losses are acceptable. Whew. I didn't think that was going to go that well when <laughs> things started to go wrong. Things started to go wrong very quickly.
But that's all right. That is all right. We've got Nagarond, and we are able to defend it. Go on, be level three. Druki Destroyer for Grom Rindle. Dwarf Bride, problem secured. It's only level two, you stingy gits. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. We'll carry on with the aftermath of taking Nagarond next time.